So, overall, as we said, when we were looking at you from this direction, the setup wise looked good, the grip was good, the shoulder tilt was good. Just be careful we don't keep going round with the no, hand. Well, Previously, that, your hand was just yeah. to left, and then you moved it to the right, yeah. and then you just kept going. And then <laughs> so it, there it is was an in between. So I... Exactly. So it's finding that kind of yeah. comfort where you need to but be. It, but it, it, it feels comfortable now. Good. As long as you know kind of where that thumb is. That. Yeah. If, if, if the hand gets too far yeah. over, the big pad yeah. of your thumb there just gets in the way of your right yeah. hand, and now your right hand's got nowhere to go, really. So that's good that you sort of clear that up, okay? But the swing issue, okay? I'm going to put some lines on here now, sort of showcasing the angles we're trying to swing on. So this sort of green line on the right-hand side yeah. here now, right on the left, basically showcases your swing plane. Okay, yeah. and the club's going to try and swing and work underneath that green line. Okay, mm-hmm. we look at the left hand one here now from before. The club went back already. Now that yes. club again, just is outside yeah, on this side of that line. Okay, club now is sort of going through the red line very steep. Yeah. As you come back down, to the club now at the top is on this side of that line, yeah. coming down now still on the wrong side, still very steep. At this point now, that club is almost vertical, yeah. and the hands you can see now are sort of quite a bit away in front of your chest there, okay? Yeah. Compare that to this one as you went back. Club now working up underneath that green line, yeah. okay? As you come back to the golf ball, that club now is working under that line really nice. Yeah. And this, this line basically represents, if you were sort of doing that pizza shot, yeah. the pizza now is sort of just a level with yeah. your chest and your neck here, yeah. and you're swinging underneath yeah. that pizza line, yeah? So the club now coming back down, all time is working underneath that green line beautifully. Yeah. Okay, so again, a much more of a, an arc, as we said, working that club around the body, and the club even then exits through under your yeah. left shoulder here, ball flying a bit straighter. What you will find at the moment is probably a few cleaner shots, maybe a few thins, yeah. because obviously the angle being a bit flatter, it's not so vertically down. Hitting the ground now is something you've got to try and almost... Yeah do whereas on this one when you're coming down that steep hitting the ground was something you almost had to try to avoid because yeah. if you didn't you just go Whoop, and stick the club in the ground too steep so working a bit flatter this is also for all clubs through the bag yeah. from wedge to driver but working on that kind of angle around the body and that's going to maximize your efficiency but just look at that angle there now yeah. just be careful not to sway when we do it okay yeah. you can see your shadow there on the ground and the ball kind of stays in between that shadow yeah. pretty good okay if we sway too far this way on the way back, hitting the ground will be, and you'd have no chance. You yeah. just top it on a real bit poppy shot there, okay? Yeah. But this one here now was very much going to be sort of, see, chopping up into that wood, just hitting yeah. down very, very steep, okay? Coming down. And that's going to result in generally the golf ball now curving off this way. And then as a result of the ball curving that way, you swung the club as far this yeah. way as you well, could, I, I just do, to help. Yeah, no, I do have some inconsistency in terms of. Topping the ball more these days. With that, yeah, exactly. the, I used to do a lot of the digging Dig, in the yeah. ground. But well, the thing is, yeah, difference. back, yeah, big difference. Yeah. The thing is, if, if we think about the golf ball on the ground here now, this will, this will lend itself sort of to the sloping lines. If I put, if that's the ground and we're going the direction the arrow's pointing, okay, we'll say yeah. using a yellow golf ball, okay? Yeah. So that ball's now on the ground, okay? Yeah. If your angle of attack is like this yeah. and then doing this, yeah. you're going to be very, very precise with that yeah. contact. If your angle of attack is more on this sort of blue line and coming in like this, oh, yeah. it's a lot easier to strike yeah. that ball. If we hit the golf ball kind of here or here or here or even there or there, we're still beneath the equator of the ball. So it's going to go up yeah. in the air somewhere. If we're coming down these red lines, it's yeah. just doosh. And if we're a little bit low, we're in underneath the golf ball, we're fatting yeah. it. Or we then try and miss the ground, we're just at the top of the so ball. The blue line's much more forgiving. The blue, and again, think about the blue line, that's more kind of the pizza yeah. art we're looking for, not the kind of yeah. the triangle V shape that we had in the past, yeah. okay? So, regards to obviously sloping lies there with that. So, if we had the best of my little drawings, okay, so there's the ground on a flat lie, okay? Yeah. And there's the ball there. You would set yourself up, kind of level, level, level. There you go, and there's you, okay? Yeah. If we tilt the line, okay, so say you're playing on the 10th, okay, and the slope now is uphill, yeah? So oh, we're going yeah. up this hill now in this direction, okay? All we would do, okay, put the ball on the ground there now, we will now change you and say, right, okay, we're going to lean with the slope so like that. Actually lean back. Yeah. yeah. Now that's going to send the ball a little bit higher, obviously, because yeah. we're going to launch it a bit higher, okay? If the slope gets very severe, swinging from a very severe tilt might be tricky. <laughs> yeah. So you might have to then take more club and swing it softer or accept the fact it's not going to go so far. Right. On the reverse of that, if we're now going down the slope this way, we go to the other way. 
So, so you put yourself on a seesaw, so, you just basically, so basically go with the slope, yeah? As the slope allows, like exactly. you said. You, you, you're keeping your body at right angles to yeah, the you, floor. I mean, someone said you, your spine's perpendicular yeah. to the ground. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So if the ground is on this line, okay, yeah. your spine is there. Right. If we just tilt you this way, yeah. move up and down, okay, re, yeah. side to side, you will then adjust yourself to the slope. Okay. And similarly, in some ways, to the slope, if you're going a ball above yeah. or ball below, yeah. whereas your spine would be here for ball above, if the ball is higher, think when I had that orange stick and I was holding a different height, what did your spine do? Yeah. It just stood up, didn't it? Yeah. If the ball's a bit lower, we go down yeah. a bit. So you'll just change your spine. So more often than not, when you're on a sloping lie, whether it be a uphill lie, or a downhill lie, or if we're going this way, a side hill this way or that way, you just set your spine angle to the slope, yeah? So you're just adjusting your spine angle. We'll actually go on the golf course next session anyway and look okay. at that in yeah. live uh, conditions. Yeah. That I get. Yeah. Um, so I think when I, if I, when I use so this so orange, so 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 orange so stick here, so say we were going down this one here now, I used to draw some lines. So if there's your spine angle no, there, I, I got, I got the and the bit, ball's there, yeah. if the ball now is up here, yeah. your spine angle will be up here, and the club's there. So you just stand up a bit taller, yeah? So you, ah. just, you stand up yourself. So when I put the when I put that orange stick up level with your chest yeah. up here, your spine was pretty much here and your arms yeah. were out there, weren't they, yeah? Yeah. So you just vertical. Yeah. And then obviously the ball gets below your feet. If you've right. got long legs like me, yeah. it's a long way down. Yeah. We've got to tilt an awful amount to get down yeah. to that golf ball. So I couldn't... So, for example, on the side of the seventh on the Mac, the one that curves on the corner, if that ball's down sort of the, on the right-hand yeah. side and the ball's way below my feet, yeah. I can't really do a full swing. So I'm just like, okay, I'm just going to tip up the side of the fair and then play my full swing from there. So the angle of the ground can be something yeah. that affects the lie of the ball. Is it a good lie or a bad lie, yeah? If it's really severe slope, okay, you can't play it. The side of the tenth could be another one as well. If the ball's way above your feet on the tenth, you're up here somewhere. Maybe <laughs> quite a, a tricky shot there, yeah? Is that okay then with the side hill lies, yeah? Uh, Maybe not quite as it understood, but you, we can no. do it. When you're out there on the course, I'll, you'll I'll probably see it. I'll think about it, it at home tonight. And I think round to nothing doesn't make much difference, obviously, does it? <laughs> when well, we get out Well, that's what I want to do next. We're going to come up here. Yeah. I've booked him for three thingy sessions. Okay. Here. But this week, like I went out on the yeah. button, yeah. I want to go out. Yes, that's what I want. And, and My intention was to go today on the course. Practice some of the Definitely work pizza on that thing. Thing. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Get that uh, sensation with yeah, you. Yeah, you know, I realise it's all about practice. It's mm -hmm. all, but it's also about discipline, doing it when you're playing. Yeah. And I think knowing what to practice Thinking, and being aware yeah. and understanding the concepts. So any time yeah. if you go away, go, and, and if you're on the golf course, this is, again, honest truth, if you're on the golf course and you're like, I'm not getting it, just yeah. send me a text, I'm on the course, yeah. I'm doing this, help. Pretty yeah. good chance I can maybe reply, okay, yeah, da da da, -da within a few minutes, hopefully, okay? And just give your response yeah. back as we can. All right? Yeah. Happy with that, are you? Oh, yeah. Good.